my left, from Salem, New Hampshire, weighing in at 218 pounds, New Hampshire's favorite son, the firebrand, Ryan Fury! His opponent to my right, from San Francisco, California, Weighing in at 195 pounds, the Psychedelic Warrior, Dave Cole! Oh, fans beyond wrestling, Denver, Colorado, the man not the place, starting oh, things off hot and heavy. We've got Donovan Dijak Cole in the action, oh. and Dave Cole, yeah. look at the Dave Cole bomb right there. Like close call for Brian Fury. A bit of a cheap shot by Dave Cole. Well, I must have been watching my match. I was doing commentary with Dave Cole, uh, excuse me, with Brian Fury last month for Dave Cole's match with Drew Gulak. And, you know, me and Fury kind of came to the conclusion that Dave Cole was not ready for that match. I think that that injury took a lot out of him. Jesus, and now we're seeing really a much right. more aggressive side. I mean, we're seeing the greatest hits of Dave Cole. We're not even a minute into this match. He's really gunning for Brian Fury today. It's a much, much, much more aggressive side than what we saw out of Gulak. It, did, it didn't seem like he could match the technical acumen of Gulak. And I I don't think that he can match the technical acumen of Brian Fury either, to be honest with you. However, that doesn't mean that Dave Cole doesn't have something that he can bring to the ring in order to be able to defeat Brian Fury. He might have to string together some combinations. I mean, you tell me. Fury trained you. What, what are his weaknesses? Or Fury's weaknesses? Uh, he doesn't have many. He's, he's well prepared. He's in great physical condition. I mean, right now it seems that he was caught off guard. Maybe he... He took the, the friendship that he and Dave Cole has for granted. Sure, he didn't, I mean, these, he didn't assume are, that his buddy would, would uh, jump him from the start. And he's, these are two pillars of, of New England independent wrestling, so. Yeah. Gary's definitely been caught off guard. You can see right from the get-go. He's, he's been putting a world to hurt. He's been in three or four submissions already. We're not, we're not two minutes into this match, and Brian Fury looks like he's, he's, uh, he's hurting. It's going to be interesting to see whether or not Fury can weather the storm or if Dave Cole's new strategy that is reformulated after wrestling Drew Gulak last month is going to work to his benefit. Fury, though, he knows so many holds and probably even more counters. Certainly hyper-aggressive. I mean, Fury's already dished out a couple of counters, but once you get really cinched into these submissions, those counters go right out the window because it takes a lot of strength, that, that upper neck strength, the lower back strength, and Fury's losing all of that every second that he's in this cross face. He couldn't find an escape right here. Instead, Fury getting under the ropes, and Dave Cole dangerously close to being disqualified. Fury not afraid to use the ropes. He's a ring veteran. He knows where he is. He's a ring general. He, he always knows where he is in that ring, and if he needs to, if he needs to, to use the rules to his advantage, he definitely will. Cole's starting to slow things down. I almost got to wonder if this is part of Fury's plan, or Fury's plan is basically out the window wow. at this point. Whiplash on that left arm looked devastating there. Cole has been looking for that cross face. But Fury the veteran, able to sidestep Cole. Oh, caught him with a back fist right on the apron. Yeah, Cole's got to be careful he doesn't spill down to the floor. It's a rough, rough landing out there, as I just found out. Fury's yeah, looking for Cole. the shoulder block to knock him to the floor instead. Oh, high risk. Boy, he's... He's in a rough spot. Oh my God, Fury's head off the canvas, the hardest part of the ring. You know, the worst part is not only the impact of the feet being driven into the chest, but like you said, the head bouncing off the apron. Like a basketball, that might be it. You know, Brian Fury somehow musters the strength. I don't know how he's still with us after that one. I mean, he, that, that, that whiplash, I mean, all of that weight. Dave Cole's not a small guy coming down off the top turnbuckle and then his head bounced like a basketball. It's gotta be devastating. Cole's the type of guy, though, that he wrestles every match like it's his last. I think that's why, unfortunately, he's faced so many injuries in his career. And just like that, one risk too many, the power bomb into the that's submission, it. and Fury already victorious here at New England Mania. That's how quick that branding iron will get you, man. That You strapped that thing on for one second. I mean, we saw Brian Fury, he was able to last through a few submissions, grueling pain on the back of the neck, but but you get that, that Boston Crab, it's all over. Well, Jack, congratulations on your victory earlier tonight. Obviously, another tough loss for Dave Cole. Everybody, please subscribe, youtube.com slash beyondwrestling.